In this video, we are going to talk about three things in the future that's going to change or something that's going to happen in the next few months. So yeah, it's almost end of the year, it's like September now. So, so I'm going to break down the next three things, which is school, home, and YouTube, which is the three main things I'm going to do, like going to change or something that need to happen or must happen like this all the things must happen so first let's talk about school so my school is going pretty well yeah i know it's year 11 and there's a lot of things going on like design my project is like due like next term week four or week three after i submit my project which is like week four, I think, yeah. So after week four, we're starting to learn like year 12 things and yeah, it's moving faster and faster. The speed is going much faster. I feel the speed, like I feel the teacher are pushing and pushing and pushing faster and faster. So when we finish one exam, we'll just keep moving to next chapter or next unit. So it's pushing, pushing, pushing. So project is like, oh, my design project is like 12 pages and all the pages are full of things. Total is 12 pages and it doesn't include title page. So teacher gave us a guideline which is one week two pages. So it's not too much and not too less. So but two pages is still going pretty tight, like the schedule is pretty tight. So this is my project which is I haven't done all of it because it's due next term not this term so yeah it's nearly getting there it's almost half a way to the project before i was at school and i was like oh my gosh there's meeting every day and there's school work every day and i gonna edit video for school and taking videos for school and taking photos for school so everything was pretty tight and I have not much time to go on YouTube so that's why I haven't been post on YouTube videos since like March? No, a long time so the teacher's job is to collect the videos I needed for edit so as I said, the link is below, you can go check it out last term, last day of school, the school announced student can upload a short video about Australia because it's going for two weeks holiday like before on July later on we have like another two weeks holiday so our school have a music center which is have sing person and like playing guitar drums whatever piano yeah so the background music basically is from our school not copyright so yeah, at the end you will see a credits, which is... So basically, photographer and editor is hard, you know? You know, being a content creator and being helping school to edit, to take photos, videos, those stuff, as you know. So that's all the things that happening before and some things were going on in the future. So second is home. So. I have reproduced my home, which is my room, like a bit as you know from the last video. So I can show you around, but just a quick tour, but I'll do a full tour on my room, maybe in the future videos. So yeah, just a quick tour from how it looks like and how I use my space nicely take a quick tour and let's go so this is the front door and 
I'll start when I come into my room. So when I come to my room, as you can see, tables, all my things, my breakfast, whatever, and my project, which is there, and water bottle, laptop, my stand, which is for my camera. I was doing a speech or having a speech with you guys. And this is my bed, which is a bit messy. I haven't tidied up, but I will do it when I finish record my video. So inside there, there's a big two glasses, which is my clothes in there, which is a bit messy, but yeah, I'm sure you don't want to see that. And the last thing, lenses, you know, action camera, and that's for the phone for gimbals. So, and here's my hard drive, and yeah, some bag, and for my personal things, headphones, watches, and for my cleaning lenses material, as you think. So yeah, that's basically what my room looks like, and I know behind the scene is a bit messy <laughs> around. And before I have a table, I have reset my room for three times, four times, a lot, <laughs> being a lot. So before my bed is like there, that space is. So now my bed is moving here. I think it's better. Yeah, I think it's better to move it here. And before my table was like, what? Like here? It, it was like, yeah, it was like here. So my bed is like there. So when I finish recording, I can jump on the bed and do my editing. So yeah, I think I changed three times, four times. I think three times, but this bed is definitely heavy. So I definitely don't want to move it around again. So, so the main things is here. I pull off the glasses, which is you can open and close and that doesn't look good in my frame. So yeah, I decide to remove it and that'll be better. Looks, and um, yeah, looks better, looks clean, you know, as usual. So in my future home, might looks like this. So yeah, it's nice, clean, tidy up, not messy. So that's a quick tour of my room. More likely is being like here two and a half. Yeah, two and a half, nearly, but yeah, I'm going to stay here like till November because in future I'll change homestay, which is we live in homestay and we move it around. So that's basically that's going to change in the future. So it's like less than two months. I'm going to change homestays. So this room is not pretty big, as you see. I was having quick tour of my room, and. Yeah, it was messy and beat them pieces everywhere. Just messy. So, yeah, I will change to another homestay. I'm thinking about to change to my year 12 homestays because I have friends which is going to graduate soon. So, I might change to his homestay. Maybe, I will talk to teachers first. But I more likely want to live closer than train station. Like, going to school by train, and going to city by train. Wherever I go to far places, I need to go by train, you know. That's what a international student do. What? Like this. So. Everyone do it like this, so I do like this. My YouTube channel. So, before I have decided to do daily vlogging, but now, nah. Of course, daily vlogging is like getting tougher because I want more views and I want more people to watch my videos, which is you guys and getting more subscribers and Basically, I want to have a great content 
which is I'm not doing daily vlogging so daily vlogging is like one day you produce a video another day you produce another video and 365 days in a year you have 365 videos that's not going to make a lot of great content like every day you are like rushing so the great word is rushing so you are just rushing and rushing and rushing creating videos and that's not going to make a great content as creating a video every day so I decided to do two videos per week. I will start like this and in future I'm gonna change, I'll tell you guys. So of course in my channel I'm gonna create better content for you guys and yeah so in future it might be like I'm going through editing software because some people are trying to do daily vlogging but Maybe in the year or half a year, you will find out, you'll be like, oh my gosh, I'm going to burn out because it's so tough. You have work to do, you have family to take care, and you have vlog to do. <laughs> so you're going to burn out pretty soon. So that's my experience. So burn out pretty soon. And it's not a good thing to burn out. Like, because you burn out, you just want to sleep all day, you know, lying down growing Instagram, Facebook, whatever, sending message. So yeah, that's how I feel before like doing daily vlogging, like, oh, waking up, I don't want to do, but today it's like, okay, I'm starting a new thing. So I decided to start film, taking camera and go do it, whatever it is. So whenever you wake up like 11, 12, maybe 7. My routine now is like like wake up at 5, sleep at 10. Like 10 o'clock at night is like getting tired, really tired because it's like, I don't know, my routine is just going like this. So yeah, like 5 a.m. I wake up, maybe make some breakfast. After breakfast, decided to do my whole day things. So look at my calendar of course I have record all the things I can remember all the meetings and finding teacher finding students filming things remember whole things in my head so I decided to put it in my laptop and that's better if you are doing daily vlogging you might be a person like people who is like a youtuber and doing daily vlogging for a whole whole year and a whole more than five years, whatever. So daily vlogging isn't a good experience for being a YouTuber or because you want to create a great content. You don't want to do like rushing videos and publishing every day. So yeah, I found it is like tough. Before I was doing daily vlogging, it was like a rushing, like rushing every day. When I got home, quickly do my homework and after doing homework I knew to edit videos and upload videos and it was just oh my god my I don't have spare time to like oh, relax. My future channel will look like I'm doing editing tutorials maybe and maybe some of it is about camera gears which is I'm using. I have future video to make so I won't tell you what camera I'm using but it's nice and of course this camera is by my parents which is by gift my birthday gift which is coming soon so yeah I have camera gears there up there all the things there so I'll talk about in the future so stay tuned in my channel so of course my sister which is Yes, my sister, she's in Taiwan, she wants to film or taking videos, starting taking videos. So she wants to learn how to take videos and edit videos, which is I'm doing now. Like being a YouTuber or content creator, whatever you call it. I think 
that's all for this whole thing for my school, for my home, for my YouTube channel, which is before what's happening and happening in the future. So all the things we go through will happen. So yeah. So like every month, I will create a video like this, which is talking face to face and what's happening in my life and yeah. So. Sometimes I'll post some stories on my Instagram. If you haven't followed me on Instagram, make sure you go and follow here because that makes a whole lot different to my channel. So make sure you subscribe, you know, the algorithm things than YouTube. You know, make sure you subscribe and put a thumbs up. And I will see you in the next one.